Sunday, there were 20,000 Rebel fans in Omaha to witness the school's first College World Series title. Tonight, thousands more packed the streets and the seats in Oxford to continue the celebration. News Channel 3's Andrew Ellison with a look at what Oxford does best. Throw a party. Thousands of fans lining the streets of downtown Oxford, celebrating the University of Mississippi's first ever men's national championship. The championship parade ending at a packed Swayze field with the Swayze crazies in full swing. The exclamation mark on an incredible playoff run, the unranked, unseated Rebels were the last team into the College World Series and ended as the last team standing, steamrolling quality opponents like Arkansas, Auburn, and Oklahoma. But some of it's just innate, you know, and where kids just have, you know, that toughness, that belief, you know, uh, in themselves, uh, which permeates through the team. It's, you know, their belief uh, in one another. Coming back from near death after regular season missteps, the preseason top five Rebs knew they had the talent. They just had to put it together. You know, you, you don't have to listen to the outside noise and what, what others are saying. Just stay together as a team and keep fighting. Keep fighting no matter what. Keep believing. And I can tell you this, Rebels fans we talk to, if you ask them what's next, they believe more national championships are still to come. In Oxford, Andrew Ellison, News Channel 3 Sports.